Hello LBG Nation, my name is Linus and welcome back to my let's play of The Walking Dead Season 3, A New Frontier. In the last part of Episode 4, Javier went to the medical room and met back up with Clementine. And then we had another Clementine flashback about Kenny and AJ. And then we had a talk with Dr. Lingard to figure out where AJ was, but he wanted to kill himself, and he would only tell us if he killed himself. But I think I messed up and I chose an option to not let him kill himself. He didn't give us any information on where AJ was. Well anyways, I'm gonna continue with part three of episode four, Thicker Than Water. Javi, you're back. And Clementine. Thanks for the warm welcome. Just surprised to see you is all. Oh, hell. You okay? Yeah. yeah. It looks worse than it is. I just got stabbed. Kate's lying down in the other room for a bit. Is she okay? So you got the guns, huh? We got them, all right. One for you, and one for you. And those are I giant automatic as well. No, I've already got one. Actually, it wouldn't hurt to have another. Yep, you can have gun, Thanks. two guns, one in each hand. What took you so long? We went to see Dr. Lingard. At night? I'm kind of surprised he was sober. Not really. <laughs> it's gotta be a stressful job. Looking after an entire community? Can't say I approve he of the way help. he blows off steam, though. The guy's clearly an addict. He was destroyed when we got there. It would be sad if it wasn't so reckless. It's pathetic is what it is. Oh yeah, Clementine's kind of mad that Why we didn't help him to kill okay. Uh, Lingard. Okay. The sun will be rising in a few hours. Jones people know we're holed up here, and they're gonna come looking for us. Okay, they All already know. Ah, for fuck's sake. Maybe it's not as bad as we think. Fucking figures. And there's no going anywhere with those things blocking our exit. They like me, that has to help somehow. Um, Just because they like you, doesn't mean they're gonna like the yeah, rest Yeah, stop of wasting us. time. We're sitting ducks up here. We've still got time to get in front of this before Joan can do anything. Yeah! Now, I don't know about you, but I'm not gonna sit around and wait for her to find us. I'm liking the cut of your jib, Javi. We can't just cut and run, not with the herd out there. Like it or not, we're fucking stuck in Richmond. Use the herd to How our the advantage, fuck are we maybe. We gotta put the brakes on this thing. Joan and her people are going to be at the square, right? We need to bring the fight to them. We go after Joan, our problems are solved. Great. So, how do we do that? It's a good question. Joan will probably um, have a full security detail with her. She'll be insulated. From us and from Return anybody David in to power. who doesn't agree with what she's doing. The best way to get rid of Joan is to get David back on top. If he's in charge again, things will go back to the way they used to be. No arguments here. After we take Joan out, we're gonna need some way out of this mess. Now, I don't know about the rest of you, but I'm not much of a runner. We've got a truck, a big one, that we used to use for walker defense. It's a little busted up, but it's way better than nothing. People are going to be patrolling these streets looking for us. How far away is this truck? I'll show you. We've been expanding, pushing out further, making the safe zone even bigger. Can't promise you they've cleared all the walkers yet, but that's where the truck's parked. <laughs> I could spit and hit it. We steal that thing, nothing will be able to stop us. Okay, so Feel now we what? have a transportation. Hey. Jesus, Javi. Is that blood on your shirt? Yeah, I just got you stabbed. You said it wasn't that bad. It isn't. How the hell did this happen? Oh, um, you're bleeding right through that bandage. You should have told me. As yeah, soon I'm not as gonna pu uh, push Things Gabe under went a the bus. Sideways at the end. Gabe got in the way. A guard came after me and he stabbed me in the shoulder. Oh, I thought you guys were gonna be careful out there. Hey, don't worry about it. It is what it is. Thought you knew what you were doing. You're still alive, aren't you? Eleanor, yep. can you take a look at this? It's all stitched up already. As long as he keeps it clean, it should be okay. Would you guys stop making such a big deal about it? It happened. It's over. Move on already. I'm just trying to make sure he's okay, Gabe. What we need to be talking about is the plan. 
Oh, yep. I have a bunch of ideas. I want to be the one to go after Dad. Just give me a gun um, and I'll do whatever. I know the town. I know what Dad's going to do. Just slow down. Hey, 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 slow down, would you? You're getting way ahead of yourself. Who's to say you're even coming along, kid? Are you fucking kidding me? Ugh, this is bullshit. I'm not staying behind. Gabe, take a breath. He's my dad. I'm going. It's going to be dangerous out there, and I don't want anyone else getting hurt. If we get to save dad, then getting hurt is worth it. It's worth dying for. This is more important to me than um, anyone else. I've got a gun, and I know how to use it. Nobody's gonna no way die. Anybody is dying. Not today. That's why we have to take the time to talk it through. So everybody comes out okay. Nobody here is gonna let you be a martyr, Gabe. Your life is precious. Life is precious? Then how come you shot Conrad, huh? Back in the tunnel, when he came after us, he tried to bargain with you. Um, you I saved your life. I saved your life too, in case you didn't remember that part. So what? You shot him. You killed him. What the fuck, Javi? Is she telling the truth? You murdered my friend? What the fuck did you do that for? You looked me in the eye. He would have killed them. He had a gun on them. If I hadn't killed him, he was going to shoot Clementine and Gabe. He's telling the truth. When Conrad found out that I used to run with New Frontier, he went crazy. He would have pulled the trigger, no question. I guess we'll never know, right? Because he's not here to tell his side of things. You made sure of that. Looks like you're a pretty fucking dangerous person to be around, Avi. First you kill my friend, then you get me and my friends on Joan's shit list? I think you need to give us some space, Javi. Fuck that. I don't want to see you ever again. Well, maybe I'd be better off with Joan. At least I know she wants to stab me in the back. You get the fuck out and you stay gone, or I can't be held accountable. You feel me? We could take care of ourselves. I'm sorry it happened the way it did. Really. Conrad wasn't a bad guy. The situation was just... just fucked. We better go get that truck. I'll, uh, get my stuff. Then call you on the walkie when I see things getting started in the square. Okay, it doesn't seem like anybody's here. Clem, you come with me to get the truck. Gabe and Kate, you guys hang back here. Be ready for anything. I see what's going on. You're punishing me because I told everyone what you did, right? Screw that. I'm going to get the truck. You stay behind and keep watch. Keeping watch is an important job, too. Not as important as getting that truck. Hey, Gabe. I know Come keeping on. watch is more important. I need you to watch my back on this one. Yeah. Okay. Okay, of course you'll listen to her. <laughs> what? Nothing. Gabe and I will be fine back here. Okay, is that the truck we're trying to get? Maybe. Locked. We can't catch a break. <sighs> Where those would probably rip this old truck apart in seconds. Okay, we'll talk to Clementine to figure out what we're supposed to do. What's going on? Thanks. 
For what? Helping out with Gabe. He's having a rough time. Yeah, we all are. I'm just doing what I can. Let's keep looking for that truck. You got it. Oh, so... Um, it would probably be in the garage. Yeah, that looks like a truck. There it is. Let's go. What are the chances? I'd say about 50-50. Smart ass. Okay. Okay, and who who are those people? I know they're part of the New Frontier. Hell yeah, this graveyard shift is killing me. Oh, we get there. Early risers. Come on, we gotta hurry and finish before more people wake up. What are we gonna do? We can't start the engine, not without attracting a lot of attention. Kate, you steer. The rest of us are gonna get behind the truck and push. See if we can't get some distance between us and them. Okay, that's better than the idea I was gonna say. I was gonna say maybe sneak in and kill them quietly. Ready? So we Ready. would have less people to deal with Ready. later on. Okay, almost there. Uh, turns out you needed me after all, huh? I'm just saying, I know you didn't want me to come along. Yeah, glad, glad you're, you're here. here. Okay. Uh, at least you can admit it. Yeah. Well, it turns out you're pretty useful when you actually follow directions. I don't think those guys will be able to hear the engine all the way over here. Um, I really? Put it in neutral. Couldn't find an ignition key in there. Guess you'll have to hotwire it. I feel like in real life, people would still be able to hear Try the engine from yourself. that far away. Shit. I'll need something to strip the wires. They left all uh, their supplies knife lying or around. something. Bet there'll be some tools out there somewhere. Just try to hurry, okay? Oh, a toolbox is right there. Okay, wire cutter. Okay, no. And you killed him with a hammer that's like the classic zombie weapon. Almost there. Keep an eye out while I get it started, okay? I'll check on the guys in the office. Clem and I will look out for walkers. Okay. Here goes. Okay, time to hotwire. Should help with this. Okay, am I supposed to cut all of them? Gotta connect the battery to the ignition. Okay, connect the Let there be light. Okay, no, that's uh, attracting them. And of course. Oh shit. 
killed the shit out of them. Really. I should have cut that I should have cut that wire first. Don't get electrocuted. Don't get electrocuted. Okay, don't get electrocuted, like you said. Yeah, I'd get in. And then the other get people can uh, take care of the zombies for us. And hopefully they did not see who we were. The square is a couple of blocks away. This is a good place to wait. Do we have enough gas? Well, not I do not know. What now? We wait for Ava to call us on the walkie. So, nothing for us to do but sit and watch the sun come up. Well, I know we've got something important to do. I'm teaching you to play Euchre. That's what not is that? a real thing. It's a card game. Come on, it's fun. It's nice to be driving around with a couple kids in the back seat again. Really takes you back, doesn't it? Just you and me and Gabe and Mari. Better times. You're right. This is nice. Like if I just close my yeah, eyes. Yeah, but right sucks that Mari more. died. All of us together. Do what I do. Try to think about the nice stuff, not everything that happened after. <laughs> gotcha. Oh, come on, that's not even a good rule. Still gotcha. Guess he stopped playing it cool with her. Hmm? Uh, in case you haven't noticed, Gabe's got a little crush on Clementine. Yep, he does. He right likes her. You get it? Well, okay, I, sort of I hope it works out for them. Okay, so I really do. They're good for each other. I think. Think their first official date will be target practice? What would um Lee think about him, though? Uh, young love. It's so normal, you know? Like, as crazy as things get, as terrible and tragic and just yeah. stupid, there's nothing more wonderfully ordinary as two kids falling for each other. Not that they're there yet, but to feel something that intensely for another person... Falling is easy. There is. Hey, the falling in love is the easy part. It's the staying in love part that'll really mess you up. It's unfair. Yeah. That's all I'm saying. That they're feeling what they're feeling right now, and when that sun gets a little higher, it's right back to the fight. Yep. I just wish he could have had a childhood, you know? I wish I could have given them that. Him and Mari, both. They deserve You still than can. This. That's why we're doing this thing. Right? So he can have a better life after everything's said and done? You're right. I know you're right. I hope you know, Javi. Having you there with me, right by my side, all this time. That's what made the difference. You're so sure of what you're doing all this for. You didn't run away. You could have. Yeah, people like need me. I'm here so I can set an example for people. For Gabe especially. Someone to be proud of. Someone who sticks around. I get it. There's no graceful way to say this, so I'm just gonna say it. I know we've had moments. You and I. And they're always a little hot and a little confusing and maybe some of them haven't meant anything at all <laughs> but before whatever happens tomorrow happens I need you to know whatever this thing is between us I want to give it a chance and I know the fact that David is back in our lives now makes this whole thing yeah a he does not know at all complicated but do you feel the same way? I'd really like to know before things get crazy. We might Yeah, I'm sure Javi feels the same way. 
Let's go for it. We gotta try, right? Oh my god, really? Really. Don't know how so David's gonna, gonna feel, though. Okay. Yeah. Shit. We're doing this. You do realize we're gonna have to have a weird conversation with David, right? Yeah. It's the right way to play this. He already got the sense I was pulling away. I just want to be able to tell him in person. Yeah, I hope he can handle it It'll at feel least. That way. I hope he can handle it. I know he's good under pressure, but this is different. Yeah. Here's hoping he doesn't completely flip out. Considering we're about to save his life, maybe he'll cut us a break. Javi. Yeah, it's maybe. An execution over here. She's planning to hang David in front of the whole crowd. That's what the platform they were building now. was. Don't bring the truck. If they see it, they'll kill him right away. If you can just get into the square. Shit. We gotta get over there. Now. So they're about to Salem witch him to death. I'm going to hang back here with the truck. Keep the walkie close by. We'll tell you as soon as we've got David. Good luck. Nothing else from Ava? Nope. And it sounds like a crowd out there. It sounded like Ava got cut off by something. Or somebody. Yep, that can't be good. Wish we had some idea of what we're heading into. Like, is the whole plan shot? Or did she just have a little setback? Um... I hate not knowing. Yeah. Okay, I did not have time to say anything. We're not gonna know what went wrong until we actually do this thing. So, let's do it already. You ready? Ready as I'm gonna be. Glad to hear it. We're gonna have to kill some people, probably. He didn't do anything. I can't wait for the others, can we? For years now, Richmond has been governed by one simple principle. Strong council, strong community. Just but expose her ass again. The actions of one of the members of that council, our security expert, David Garcia, have put us all She's in lying to all of you. I'm sorry to have to show you this. Truly, I am. But you all need to see. Just look what he's done. He didn't do anything. Who is that? He murdered this man in cold blood. Is that Badger? Is this who we want in charge? Someone this reckless? This cruel? Not if I have anything to do with it. I can't believe this is really happening. She's going to kill him. She can't do this to him. He's kept him safe. Don't lose your cool. Try to keep your cool. Joan's smart. But we're smarter. We just have to be careful. We can't screw this up, Javi. Javier! I heard you were planning to crash our little party. Why don't you come on up here? Show your face to everyone. I'm sure these people would um, like to hear what you have to say. I'll be happy, happy to. to. Just give like a day. speech. Then I'll try not to disappoint you. I had a very interesting conversation with your friend Eleanor last night. Isn't oh, that right, shit. Eleanor? We did. She said you came here because you wanted to save your brother. Yes. Admirable. Almost. Don't know how you thought you were going to pull it off. Considering it's all of us against the three of you. Why punish David? If you knew what we were coming here to do, why go ahead with this? Why put a noose around my brother's neck? This community deserves justice, and they're going to get it. One way or the other. Here in Richmond, 
people who put themselves before the group don't last long. Bring them out. Get away from me. You're making Shit. a mistake. Ava! Oh no. They had them this whole time. David wanted to tear this whole place down. No. He told his people where to find our gun supply, and sure enough, they picked us clean. She didn't tell you us. You really thought you could ride into town and stage a coup? With our own damn weapons? Something like that? I can't just let it go. You've put me in a no-win situation here. So I'm going to do the same thing to enough, you. Enough, enough. Stop. Both of them Stop. deserve to die for their crimes. No, they However, don't. Javi, I'll let you spare one of them. Mm. Just uh, fuck. one. No! Hell no! Joan! Don't! Not after what they tried to do. You may be guilty of bringing them into this, but they Take chose me instead. to go along with it. If you're going to punish anyone, it should be me, not them. So ready to sacrifice yourself for others. Don't worry, Javi. I'm not through with you yet. Of course. Joan, are you sure about this? We never agreed to killing all these people. It's really up to Harvey, Step up isn't now, it? please. All eyes are on you. Maybe this will help you make up your mind. Boys? <gasps> Come on, Harvey. Who's it gonna be? Your friend? Or your brother's lieutenant? I'm gonna have to save Trip. Trip has to live. He's invaluable. Son of a bitch. Javi, what the fuck is wrong with you? I you know. You're making David happy, but I respect you for sticking up for your own people. Shoot it. Wait, I said Trip should live. You did, but there's something else you need to understand. What? Betrayal. You can't do this. Fucking figures. I can do anything I want. You brought this on yourself. Do it. No. You I'll pay for. No. No. What the fuck? No. Why? Oh they really shot him. God damn it. Now, David, it's your turn. No. Please step up, other members. I can't believe this. This isn't how we do things. This is yes, madness. Yes, finally. Stop, Stop her. her Clint. Is this the process you trusted? No. Think about then this. Do Bobby. something. You know what's going to happen. You're the only one. You ready for that? We don't murder in Richmond. We exile. That's how we've always done things. How about you take David and the rest of your people and just get the hell out? Go far away from Richmond and then whatever you do is up to you. I'm sure the herd outside would like that. She thinks she's sending us out there to die. She's counting on it. Everybody put your guns away. We're gonna handle this peacefully. Yeah, you're in charge too. Ah. He's still alive. Don't listen to them, Javi. They're fucking butchers, all of them. Shoot that bitch. Take her out. She deserves it. If you uh, don't do it, I fucking will. I'll Go shoot her. Hell, Joan. Ah, no. Cut the rope or something. Cut the rope or something. Okay, you're okay. Make things right. Oh, okay. Dad needs us. We gotta get out there. Yeah, I'm on your tail. He 
needs you, not me. Go on. Thanks. Stay safe. Yep, don't let Clementine die. We had a way out of this hobby. Why did you have to go and shoot her? Shit, get down! I hear gunfire! What the hell is going on over there? Are you guys okay? Uh do you need a pickup? Or do you have things we'll come under to control? You. Stay away from the square. It's too risky. We'll come to you. I I can't hear you. It's too loud. Okay, a smoke bomb. Or knockout gas. <laughs> no, hurry up. Okay, bam. Really? We told you to stay there, it's but you couldn't hear us, She's though. Coming for us. Don't hit any in this. Okay, no. Not that Malvatal. Really? Oh, and God. is that all the gas? You gotta get over there before. She better not be dead. No. Okay, we gone and fucked up, and of course that's the end of the episode probably, of course it is, it always has to be on a cliffhanger, okay now we're gonna check the choices of what other people did, did you promise that you would help Kate with the family if David left? You and 91% of the players promised you'd help Kate. How did you respond to Dr. Lingard's request? You and 46% of players d refused to kill Lingard. 52% killed him. And then 1% let Clementine decide. Did you tell Kate that you have feelings for her? You and 78% of players chose to f share your feelings. And then the 22% didn't. Who did you try to save in that execution? You and 41% tried to save Trip. And the 58% tried to save the other girl. Did you shoot Jane or take Clint Steele? You and 56 of players chose to shoot Joan. And then the 43% made the deal. Uh, nope, I already played this game. And that was the end of episode 4. If you enjoyed this video, a like would be appreciated. And if you're new to my channel, consider subscribing. And don't forget to hit that bell button to get notified whenever I post a new video. And as always, this has been Linus. Have a wonderful day, and I'll see you all next time on my adventure into the world of gaming.